Oh, this game knows I like climbing mountains. I do. But I also don't want to get one hit by every zombie in the game. So we're going on a hike, baby. Sticky with the hike. That is an aggressive stamp. Did, <laughs> did they need to make that so loud? Uh, we're going Jill Valentine. What a... What a, what a shocker. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Safe with the remaining body of Kevin. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. No. I'm going with her. No. Look, honestly, I have nothing to add to that dialogue. Sometimes you just gotta let it play out, okay. Gotta get used to the controls again. It's been a very long time since I've played this. I think you'd better take a look at this. Barry again. Blood. <laughs> you guys gotta give me some credit. Of course, I finished Resident Evil Remake before. It's been a few years though, so if you ask me where any of the keys are, if you put a gun against my head, I'd just say shoot me, baby. I don't know where they are. So this is the the wooden shield. Um, it's going to help protect us from the armies of the living dead, I believe. It's actually an emblem. I think we put this in the wall somewhere, which will help us with a puzzle. Welcome to the walkthrough. <laughs> oh, what an iconic scene. I think I saw this originally when I was in the single digits of the age. Um, didn't sleep for about four months. That was... A productive four months of fucking primary school though, dude. Alright, we're gonna yeet out of here. I think Barry Burton can kill this. We can save some bullets. I'm all about saving bullets. Fucking door animations. <laughs> Yo, Barry, you licking the blood again, you freak? There's a there's a zombie coming. Look out! It's a monster! Not Jill, I wasn't I wasn't licking the blood again, I was Let just seeing if it was Chris's. Because I can tell by sight. Barry's not the best shot, but you know, he gets the job done. The zombie just get up and leave. You're gonna investigate the blood for eight hours, but you're gonna ignore that. I don't know if games can be bangers, but this game is a slapper. Resident Evil Remake originally was my favorite Resident Evil game. It got taken over by the two remake, unfortunately. Maybe the three remake, you know, that's kind of on its way. Maybe that'll take over that. Still, it's beautiful. This came out when? 2002? Six? God knows, man. I don't know. This is stretched on a PC monitor. It still looks Barry. fabulous. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. Uh, Chris is What's going on not in this here? game. I can't figure it out. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. Oh, you are the master of unlocking, after all, Jill. Thanks. Oh, we're hit with the fur. One of many pushing puzzles in the game. The pushing's a little little shaky, you just gotta kinda walk into it and hope for the best. And you don't wanna pull one of these tables. You pull the drawers, the whole drawer comes out, your forks go everywhere. And then that's just your day done. So... You, I don't remember what this is. I don't think it's a key, you don't get a key this early. You can kinda see the statue lady's butt, so I uh, just got demonetized. It's the map! Yo, yeah, Jill, you special force, you fell over? We fell over nothing. All right, we're dealing with our second Zem zombie here. As you can see, my pistol is loaded with blanks. Good thing we got this knife. Can we get those back out? Can we get? Can we just pull that one? No. And he's still he's still living. We're getting the fuck out of here. Dude. 
Kenneth. That's his name. What a name, dude. Kenneth. Kenneth's t bringing around a videotape with him, too. What a guy. I don't know why, this room has always given me the creeps. As far as I know, you don't... You're not in danger in here. But I always envision getting attacked by birds. I know birds show up. But I don't think they attack you. Maybe if you shoot them? Why would you shoot them, though? Because there's this bird cage here. It freaks me out, dude. I don't know why. It's also that well-placed mirror there. You like that? There it is. What a... what... needless... needless destruction. I can't even carry the gem. I destroyed it for no reason. God damn. Where's the nearest box? I haven't even seen a box yet. Jeez, that's a Monker S, dude. Can we get some Monker S in chat? Okay, it looks like Barry's been here. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with that. We're just gonna end that one. That is a metal book! It's, it's got skeletons holding up a goat's head. Is that what I'm- look at that! Dude, that's metal as fuck. Can we open it? Oh, key! The one thing I, I don't like about this version, it's, I say version, but the, the, this game, is Jill doesn't pull out a little sharpie and write on her map, like, hey, this is the armor door. I can, oh my god. Fucking window. What was that? The wind? It's one heck of a wind. She doesn't, yeah, she doesn't draw a little, hey, this door's locked, so here's the key I need. <laughs> if you could perish and then burn in hell. Oh my god, the, the head explosion. This music is so good. Uh. Take the dog whistle, blow that, your mother will come running. <laughs> At the risk of sounding like a Facebook post. Anyone else think this room was cozy? I don't know what's... The... Maybe it's the fire, the crackling fire. The safety. It's not even a save room. There's something about it. The thunder outside. Like, I could sit in this room in real life before getting devoured by zombies because I'm an idiot. You pit me against any boss in the game, I'm, I'm good. We don't even get a whistle sound? I'll add that in post, it'll be sick. You pit me against dogs? It's a disaster, I'm already fucked. It's gonna be my first and only death, okay? Oh my god. Can you imagine living in this place? Your cat accidentally takes your fake Key out of it. Ah, oh, and then your, your cat doesn't know how to put the key back in. All of a sudden, you're like, <laughs> don't worry, everybody. The cat's fine, okay? The cat jumped over the thing. It's all good. This is the only key I remember in the game, the, the fake one. Can we go this way yet? Uh, the kitchen. Not much to say about the kitchen. <laughs> Why am I? Why am I going this way? I know the elevator doesn't work. Don't have any power in here. I'm just running around for the sake. Look how big this pot is. I'm a zombie. Here I come. I see in 240p. I promise I won't. I won't use that really bad kitchen music. Okay? I promise. Just kidding. <laughs> Eat shit. Bring time. Who goes over? Who looks at a toilet and says that toilet certainly hasn't been serviced for a while? Look at that guy on the wall! Uh oh, Jill, how are you gonna get out of this one? Barry! Help! Jill! You in there? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! <clears throat> Grab my hand! <sighs> Barry! Looking late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. 
Hey, why are you attacking me? Because I got your puzzle wrong? Crows can't tell the difference between colours. How are they going to know? Bugger off. Piss off. <laughs> Don't scare me. That's what I was going to say. But just take a look at this. It's forest. Oh my god. It's awful. I'm going to find out what caused Forrest's death. It looks like he was killed by a crow or something. Jill, could you investigate other areas? Yeah, sure. Jill, this is no longer useful to Forrest. We don't know what's going to happen. Take it with you. I don't think Jill needs the broken shotgun. We'll take it. We'll take it anyway. Uh, that's a Chris item. He needs it to get out of the closing room or he dies. Hey, I'm in the closet. <laughs> I was waiting in the closet for you. I'm one of the smart zombies. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> sure, Jill, let's just dump whatever this is into that water. Did that water just go red? You son of a bitch. You plant motherfucker. What kind of plant is designed to slap humans? Which... Red... I'm gonna guess red... Oh my god, yeah, eat! That's what you get, human is the master race, you stupid. Oh my god, I knew it had to happen eventually. Those guys slip and slid in here. They're greased up or something. Richard! What happened? You're wounded! This whole place is a killing zone. There are monsters. What did this to you? A big snake. I'm gonna save Richard. You gotta be quick. You gotta go get the serum. I will unlock this door first, you know? May as well. It only takes a few seconds. I don't know where I'm going though. Sweet mother of mercy, it's a re-dead. It's a red head. It's Red Dead Redemption himself. What are they called? Re-deads? Red Deads. Don't know, look, just, just shake it, dude. Thank God. <laughs> I get shocked here. Oh, you want one too? I brought two of them. I brought two shockers. God damn. Oh, God, that was close. I didn't bring three, that would be absurd. The dogs! I forgot about the dogs, Lee. Fuck off. What was that attack? How does that hurt? That's my riding arm. I'm never gonna be able to get through the Christmas cards now. This is a disaster. You hit me again, I'm gonna be mad. You son of a bitch! That zombie's a clown, I tell you. <laughs> Richard did not make it. Um, I kind of forgot about him and I started doing other shit. That's a damn shame, dude. He was a good man. Anyway, I'm going to pick up these healing items right here. Oh no. I don't remember this puzzle. Do not push the button. I think these knights can kill you? Is this something to do with the, the pictures on the wall? Is this... Push him in. Push him all the way in. I think. 
Okay, here's... Do we just got to push them all in? If that's the puzzle, I'm going to be... <laughs> oh, it's one of these. A couple are connected. You got to push the right one. Oh, dude. This is easy. We just push this one back in. That'll push him in. Push the button. Get whatever's in that thing. Yeah. Okay, I always overestimate them. Barry Burton prints out an A1 sheet of paper to get his message across. <laughs> Thanks, Barry. Gave us some goods. I appreciate that. There's a <laughs> red dead guy. Oh, oh, it's the same one from before. Stay dead. Yeah, yeah. Peace out, brother. Oh. Resident Evil puzzles. That bee's alive? I put it in my pants inventory. If that thing came alive in my pants, I'd die. See you in the mirror, fatty. You don't think you think zombies can't use mirrors? Would they leap for? <gasps> Bruh. Oh shit! You killed Richard, motherfucker. And now we're gonna take you out. Let's go. Just push me along the ground, you bitch. Oh, little wrapped in on yourself. Can't get me here, idiot. There's a pipe. There you go, sliding through the environment. What a sucker. I'm poisoned. I don't think I can make it to the safe room in time. Uh, oh, poison. poison. Serum. Serum? I, do, I do remember that. Barry's gonna save us. This song is so good. Barry? It's so relaxing. Barry? I'm fairly sure this boss is just a crimson. Boy. Honestly, I'm not worried about the bosses. Bosses in this game, easy as peasy. Yeah, it is. It's just a red boy. A red boy who has a little moat control for his door. It's a little sus. Okay, we're good, we're good. A couple of shots. Oh, ooh. Is he dead? There we go. One more, you stupid bitch. Can't catch what you can't see, bitch. <laughs> no! I oh, get it, get it, get it, get off, get off, get off. Also, me and Margaret finally moved from the uh, path of revenge, and we we head up to the, the summit of madness. We thought about the valley of destruction. But, um, Joseph lives down there. Honestly, when I die, put a, put a coin puzzle on my gravestone. <laughs> Fuck off, bird. I'm trying to tell a story about when I die. Put a little coin puzzle and whoever figures it out gets to open my grave. And there I am, dead as all hell. And you just get to take, I'll have some treasure buried with me. And it's all yours, baby. <laughs> <laughs> It's the most beautiful gun in all of Resident Evil history. Oh, oh. Oh, it still gives me goosebumps. That part, the first time I played this, that part got me good. And now, then we get doinked by Lisa here. Doink. So the Lisa subplot, this character here, was never in the original Resident Evil. Oh, but it's, I can't imagine it without it now. 
One of the things I do is get venomous snakes out of tight corners. Why this country has such lethal snakes, nobody's sure. But by crikey, it sure makes my life interesting. Riddle me this, why in a game with zombies are snakes, spiders and dogs the worst thing? Huh? I'm just gonna end this thing's life. Because I don't want to ever see it again. Thanks for that, that's, that's great. You poisoned me. Got the map of the... The bees! Oh no, I forgot about the bees! They're the worst thing of all! Oh, run, run, run into a cutscene. No, that wasn't part of our deal. But it's not necessary to destroy stars. What about my family? Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. <laughs> what the fuck? This kid's crazy! Oh, okay. So you can just do that now. There's no boundaries anymore. Get the heck out of here, idiot. I had a battery in my pocket. Forgot about the damn sharks. Oh my god, the animals! are relentless in this game. Once Resident Evil found out the old here's the vision of something coming for you uh, they, they ran with it. Iris, don't bite me. Ah! Drain the water baby! And the shark knows what draining water is everyone. They must have programmed that into its brain while making it into a zombie shark. I forgot how to do this and I haven't saved for a while I think you just go around and click stuff. Stop pick, stop trying to pick up the main kit. Okay, not this, not this. Okay, we click, okay, safety released. And then, we hit the control lever. Yeah. To make the blast doors go down. What? Try again. Had to go to the oil, safety, blast doors. And now we'll be able to drain the water. There we go, baby, we drain the water. Eat shit, shark. Nailed it. You think it's pretty funny making me have to do all that again? You freaking shark! <laughs> Jill Valentine's done in this mansion. Every animal is gonna be dead. Oh man, that feels good. Hey, hey, hey! Anybody order fried sauerkraut? Fry you Nazi bastards! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Wesker! Jill, so you're safe. That's what I was going to say. I apologize. Big B Burton hitting us with the big paper in this was like, what a lad. You know, people say what they want about Bat. He fixed the door too? Oh. Here's another terrifying part when I was younger. I'm like, wait a minute, didn't I just, didn't I just come that way? Yeah, there's the big Barry piece of paper. And then, right behind you, something you've never seen before. Faster and stronger than every enemy in the game. Still hasn't worked out doors. Thankfully, so we can just leave that guy in the dust. He's figured out doors! Yikes. Okay, this bit goes... This guy obviously goes in the middle here. I don't want to adjust the pace, I just want to put it there. This part goes right here. I can see that. Get. Get. Get in there! Do you hear that? Did I leave my leg open in the background? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We'll just push this statue and then I'll close it. We'll push. Jill, we're gonna have to push this statue and all we're gonna freaking die. Is that you, Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Yeah. You're alive! Stop! Are you with anybody, Jill? No, but why? 
the stars are finished. Someone is a traitor. Umbrella set us up. Enrico! You gotta feel bad for Enrico. You know, everyone forgets about him. He comes to this mansion full of giant sharks, zombies, spiders, and bees. And then he dies to one of his friends. I mean, a mega yikes on that one. Alright, this is just what- this is- I'm used to this from Leon Kennedy. I don't think I'm saying anything controversial when I say that boss fights in Resident Evil are doo-doo. I mean, what else could I say? You, you, you're witnessing <laughs> this. This is a boss fight. What the hell is that sound? It could be a person. <laughs> It could be, Barry. Jill, go check it out. We had enough surprises for one day. I'll stay here and secure our escape route in case something happens. <laughs> what? Okay. Whoa. Hey, Barry, could you come down here and check this out? There's something in here I want you to see. Barry! See you later, fucking idiot. Finally got both the emblems. Now we can go on into the creepiest door in history. Just that backdrop of that door is... Gives me the heebie-jeebies. Always has. Always will. Jill. You're alive. I was worried, because I thought you were... Start talking. Calm down. I didn't want to do it. Believe me, I can explain. Don't lie to me. Time to talk. Jill, hand me my gun. Thanks, Jill. Okay, you guys are about to see a boss fight right here. Check this out. Step number one. We're gonna push this rock off. Step number two. Guess what? We're gonna push this rock off. Barry, back me up here. Oh, Barry. Thought he was gonna betray me again. Here we go. Block number three, Barry. Yeah, okay. That leaves us with one rock left, which is this one here. That opens up the sarcophagi. Showing Lisa, her mother's skull, in which she commits suicide. This is a good representation of, as you get older, what organs start to just hurt for no reason sometimes. What can you do? Login? My name. John. Password? Because I'm 13 years old, it's gonna be a girl I like. Ada. There you go. The UI they created for this computer is just perfect. I love it so much. The 3D model of the rooms? Oh. I love it. I like this part because it shows all the monsters. We've got Sarah Cerberus, we got Neptune. We've got the Hunter, which is a little weak. Tyrant, haven't seen that yet. A nice photo of all the boys, including Wesker. Now we put the uh, the old red filter on it. Everything's the same except at the end, the barcode is a secret code. Put the secret code into what looks like my alarm system at my house. Maybe an air conditioner. Oh! Hey, what's up guys? It's Kenneth. Filming a vlog in this spooky mansion. Oh, there's actually a zombie here. There's actually a zombie here. He's gonna... He's actually got at me. He's clawing into my flesh. Oh, he's gonna kill me. Sub you gotta have to subscribe to Kenneth to see what happens next. <laughs> I think this is the introduction of the worst enemy in the whole game. They're not in the projector though, so I don't know what they're called. These things. Ah, oh, they're just... they're awful. And they travel between rooms using the vents. It's just... We might actually see another one. There's nothing even... I didn't even need a... The pure reason to come down here. 
It's to shoot that thing. Oh, here, yeah, here we go. Sick, 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 sick. I'm in, I'm in big trouble. Of course I'm alive. Jill, there's something big going down, and I don't think we're part of the equation. I have to get you out of here. Ugh, it won't open. Wait, I'll be back to get you out. Okay, no sightseeing though. Running could result in a fatal explosion? Um, okay. Let me, let me check my controls here. Is there... I'm always running. If I hold X, will I walk? <gasps> this, my friends, is why you clear out the area with the grenade launcher. You clear out all those dead space creatures, and you can walk through here fine. You try to walk through here with that nuclear bomb in your pocket, and those creatures smacking your ass, you're going to get blown into the next generation. Warning, extremely sensitive to shock. That's, it's the fucking internet, man. Just like that, we get power to the facility. My god. You could have at least waited up for me. Oh, fuck off, Barry. You betrayed me. I know it's for your family, but come on. Oh, that sound is so good. The doom door sound effect. Wesker! You, he's betrayed Thank me again. <laughs> well, what do you know? Fucking Barry. Oh, don't blame Barry for everything. Fuck you, Wesker. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry. <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family. Yeah, Barry! You can keep betraying us as long as he keeps coming Barry. back onto our side. Forgive me. No, you're not to blame. It's Umbrella and Wesker. <laughs> Damn it! You want a piece of me? Premature. <laughs> And that's how you beat Resident Evil, baby! <laughs> Jill. Sorry about the wait. So everything's taken care of? Well, almost. Now let's get the hell out of here. Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just get in contact with Brad! No! We can make it. Jill, ladies first. Chris! Hmm? Jill. Full team. The the A squad. Look at this. Alright, I'm gonna send Nemesis at us again. It's not Nemesis. I'm gonna send the Tyrant after us again. Chris is gonna die. Free rocket launcher. This is the only way you can end a Resident Evil. I like how they give you four rounds. And it takes one, baby. Say hello to Hitler for me in hell, bitch! Resident friggin evil. What a great game even today. Uh, it still stands up. It's a, it's a great game. I love it. I love it a lot Jill you did a fine job <laughs> Thanks Wesker. At least he's a good loser. You know, he lost pretty hard. But he's like, you know, Jill you did a, you did a fine job Ooh, new costume. So thank you for watching everybody. I'm re recording this after the fact, after I've uh, kind of edited it all together. Uh, and what a video that was to make. That was, it was, probably took me about two weeks total to make. Is it worth it for me? Absolutely not. But as long as you enjoy it, as long as it feels like a, a full experience of a, a, like a, almost like a TV show length video, then you know what? It's, it's freaking worth it, dude. As long as people get a kick out of it, and I think people do. 
um, leave a comment, best comment with the word Jill Valentine will be pinned and I'll know that you got to the end of the video and you're not just some poser. <laughs> Thanks for watching everybody. Until next time, leave a like as well, okay? That's the least you can do. That's free. I spent two weeks sweating, blooding, coming. <laughs> okay, not the, not the, the